We begin today with breaking news out of Brooklyn, where two teens were shot outside of a deli. Police say mm -hmm. they were not the intended targets, and they're now searching for the suspects who fled the scene. Arthur Chien is live for us in Crown Heights, Brooklyn, with the very latest. Arthur, what do we know? We know right now that the two victims, the teenagers, have been rushed to a hospital, and we know of the two suspects. Both are still missing. One of them uh, believed to be armed, obviously, because of what happened out here. Uh, this is the scene right here. It happened at 930 this morning. This is Eastern Parkway and is right outside the Franklin Avenue Medgar Evers College subway station. Not inside the subway station, as you pointed out, Chris, but outside of it. Uh, there were some evidence uh, markers out here that showed uh, some of the shots that have been fired. Now, what police say about the shooting is that the two suspects approached an intended victim and opened fire this morning. One witness tells us they heard about half a dozen shots here. Now, police say the two bystanders that were hit, neither of them were the intended target. This is what we know about the victim so far. One is a 16-year-old girl. She was shot on the right leg. Another was a 17-year-old male. He was shot on the left arm. Both have been brought to Kings County Hospital, where they are right now. If there is any good news here is that we are told their injuries are not considered life-threatening at this time. Now, there is a school nearby that went into lockdown. The students there told us they were now allowed to go home. Some of them wondering if the victims were their classmates, obviously shaken. One witness described the sound as a burst of firecrackers. I saw boys running, but it, that, that, don't, that, don't, that didn't mean anything to me that they were running out of they thought it was they didn't want to get hurt by firecrackers. I, I saw, you know, teenagers. The school got put on, you know, shutdown, and they was not letting nobody in. And, you know, a lot of teenagers went home because the school was not letting them in. It's pretty much out of character for this neighborhood. Uh, this is, uh, uh, you know, a decent block, quiet block, uh, a lot of kids, high school kids, too. Uh, high schools are on the side here on uh, near President Street. Um, and um, we don't see this much often, especially near Eastern Parkway. Now, several of those individuals told us that this is part of the national epidemic of gun violence. They said they're not immune here in this Crown Heights neighborhood either. As for the suspects, police describe both suspects as male, dark skin, possibly teenagers. One is wearing a black hooded shirt and black clothing. The other one was wearing a red hooded sweatshirt and gray jeans. Again, those two suspects are still at large right now. At least one of them is considered armed. We're live in Crown Heights, Brooklyn. Arthur Chian, Fox 5 News. Chris, back to you.